Introducing the world's newest, silliest, and hamburger eating as clown, Ronald McDonald. Let me take you on a trip down memory lane. Three years ago, the workshop was at its peak, with every YouTuber making videos about goofy characters. The most popular at the time was Ronald McDonald. Due to Ronald being so powerful, it sparked an arms race where everyone tried to make more and more powerful characters to see who could create an unstoppable force. I received hundreds of comments per day begging me to cover this character, but I never did. I completely avoided them because the developer of Ronald himself personally requested that I do not cover this character. Today, I break that promise. I mean, it's been three years, so... He probably doesn't care. This is Ronald Gaucho. Gaucho. Ga Gaucho. Ga Gaucho. But first, we have a message from our sponsor. Hey Knuckles, guess what? Huh? We got sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Oh no. Don't be rude, Mr. Knuckles. There's a reason why the game has over 80 million downloads. Raid is a free to play game that's available on multiple platforms and it has a lot of content to play through. If you like RPGs, you might like Raid. The goal is to collect champions and build a team that is capable of fighting through all kinds of challenges. The game uses a type matchup system, like rock, paper, scissors, and depending on your team composition, you could give yourself an insane advantage in battle if you brought the right champions. There's a lot of strategy involved, which gives the game a lot of depth. Build the perfect team for you and your preferences by summoning champions. Use the QR code on screen or the link in the description to give the game a try. And in my opinion, you should try it with a group of friends since that makes the game a lot more fun. Using my link also gives you a free starter pack, which will help you progress a bit faster. And it's actually Raid's fourth anniversary. Happy birthday, Raid. Use the promo code 4YEARSRAID to get some extra goodies. Lastly, if you have Amazon Prime, keep an eye out for some powerful Savage gear coming your way. Show Raid some love because they support creators, which allows me to keep bringing you videos like this one. Thank you, Raid, for sponsoring this video. Okay, right off the bat, he looks just like normal Ronald. There's nothing actually like that special about him. Even the color palettes are the exact same. All right, we're in game and he makes the screaming sound. He's got a nice radius around him. Also, his percentage is interesting. Wait, his stocks are going up. Wait, okay, wait, this is kind of interesting actually. Yeah, let's just do the ultimate. Wow, okay, that just took away all three stocks instantly. That's um fair. <laughs> My moveset seems the exact same as vanilla. Oh, oh, mm. That's not the same. So if I just touch someone, they lose? Is that it, bro? Like, <laughs> is that simple? All right, we're gonna find out what happens if this Ronald goes against the original Ronald. I kind of already have an idea how this is gonna go, uh, and I'm taking my headset off. Yup. So this is OG Ronald right here on the left. And this is Ronald uh, Gaucho. Okay, let's just touch him with normal Ronald. Wait a minute. I'm invincible. And then if I tap him, do you die? Oh, yeah, I didn't like that. I should have kept my headphones off. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice game crash right there. Really happy we got to do that together. The original developer of Ronald, it kind of bothered him that people were copying and pasting his character and making more powerful versions of it. So he ended up just adding like this anti-cheat mechanism where anything that was more powerful than the original Ronald would just completely ear blast you and then crash the game, which is like kind of funny, but also like so petty, <laughs> like really petty. Nowadays, it's more kind of like an Easter egg because it's all built in software. But back in the day, it actually would hard crash your game and like close the application, which is like kind of virus territory if you think about it. All right, now we gotta find out what happens with Cosmic Ronald because Cosmic Ronald is more powerful than regular Ronald. Well, they were at one point in time. So I kind of just wanna see if Cosmic Ronald has any sort of anti-cheat mechanisms. All right, here we are. We got Cosmic Ronald. He's not attacking me though, I just noticed that. He just walks around me. Why does he not attack me? Is the AI unable to determine where I am, maybe? Oh. Wait, he actually took a stock from me, but Cosmic Ronald lost a stock. And then I hit him, 
and the game ends. Oh, I can hit him while he's in this death animation. Oh, wait, I didn't know this. Has this always been a thing? <laughs> I can just delay the game. All right, I'll let him finish out. You know, do what you gotta do, bruh. What a weird, weird time 2020 was. Now, before we go to the next character that's even more powerful than Cosmic Ronald, um, there's a few other things I wanna test. The Dwayne was another character from 2020 that was really popular. They don't have a hitbox, so like they're kind of invincible. So I kind of want to see the interaction between these two. All right, so as you can see, we're both kind of hitting each other. Never mind, I'm just better. I can kind of see why everyone wanted me to cover this character. It would have been a pretty funny haha -ha 2020 video, that's for sure. All right, Missing No was a fun recent guest on our channel. So we're going to go ahead and kind of see if, you know, maybe some glitches can take out the guacho. Not expecting a whole lot here, but uh, all right, it's the Amogus. You guys would be upset if he wasn't in the video, so here he is. He's he's among us. It looks like I'm glowing more than usual. Maybe the gold version does have something special going on. But I still just one shot. Wow, 2,000 stocks. That's kind of... That's a lot of stocks. All right, it's time for everyone's favorite segment on the channel. Okay, but can they beat Goku? All right, all right, we made our fun jokes here and there, we get it. Let's go back to the more powerful characters and see the actual interesting interactions. First up is Giga Chad. He actually has a legitimate boss mode. All right, Mr. Giga Chad, uh, do your thing. It doesn't look like even Giga Chad boss mode can do anything. You can tell he's in boss mode because he has the, the purple glow around him. But yeah, it's just, it doesn't seem like this character can get hit, which is kind of stupid if you ask me, but you know. It is what it is. And then, uh, you know, I just press the A button. Yep. What can you do? All right. I'm going to manually activate it down strong. All right. So now I'm in anti cheap mode, which means I should be able to do something. No, it, it doesn't look like I'm able to do anything. Bro just does not have a hitbox. So am I just truly invincible? What are the limits? That's what I want to know. What are the actual limitations of this guy? And then let me guess. I tap. Wait a minute. Ronald cannot one-shot Giga Chad. That's actually kind of cool. And I just tank it. I guess technically Ronald would win because he has more stocks. But I mean, come on, it's just two invincible people. Where's the fun in that? All right, this time we're gonna check out Kara. Kara also has a boss mode. So I'm kind of curious to see how this one goes. All right, anti-cheap, neutral special. I now have anti-cheap and as you can see, I'm kind of like Giga Chad where I just don't even have a texture because I'm so radiant. And can I tank a hit? I still can't tank a hit even with the anti-cheap. That's actually kind of interesting. I wasn't expecting that. All right, we're pulling out the Fox Ultra Instinct. This guy was probably the most powerful character in the game for a very long time. So I'm kind of curious to see how this goes. Have we even seen a character able to hit Ronald yet? I don't think so. This is just so busted. And I tap and you die. Wow. Ultra Instinct Nolan also has an anti-cheap, but his is a lot more ruthless. So I have a feeling this might be what we were looking for. He's activating his anti-cheap and he's using his uh, super beam. Now this is supposed to one-shot every single person in the game. Like it's the most powerful move like ever. It's actually crazy, but I'm just tanking it. And if I tap, if I tap, oh. All right, I guess it took a few more taps. That's impressive. I mean, if you think about it, Nolan did kind of like stay alive through a couple of hits, which is impressive, but ultimately it just wasn't enough. All right, I guess it's time to meet your maker. We're gonna do Gaucho versus Gaucho. 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 I don't know what to expect. Just buckle up. Here we go. Uh, are you, wait a minute. Okay. Um. I think that's not supposed to be a thing. Well, uh, I guess you could say Gaucho has finally fallen. At least we can quit the game. All right, well, that was an episode. I don't know what else to say. If you liked any of the characters you saw in this video, I have covered all of them. Check out our mega playlist, it's on the screen right now. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.